Three, two, one, click. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, that was a mistake. Oh. YouTube, Komodo Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of Teardown, and yes folks, we are finally back in this game, and there has been a massive update. We have workshop support, so we have custom maps, we've got custom weapons, and it's all with the click of a button. So you can see this nuclear power plant in front of us, and what we're gonna do, we're gonna grab a black hole and just go, wee. Uh oh, this is probably a mistake. Wait for it, wait for it, and... Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh-oh, by the way, I also have an AC-130 strike, but I don't think I really need it. What is happening? That looks incredible! Wait, we should totally stick a black hole in the core of this. By the way, I think you can melt down this nuclear power plant and basically create Chernobyl. So that's a thing, too. Does the black hole go away? Also, I should totally go into the options menu. I'm pretty sure there's a way to have, like, an even bigger black hole. This one looks a little broken. What happens if we shoot it with the- Oh, no! Okay, stuff's going crazy here. Okay, shoot it with a rocket. <gasps> oh, it went through. Um, we're going to ignore this is even a thing. We're just going to walk into the uh, power plant here. Or I should say, break our way in. Oh, and something's broken here. Oh, well, I mean, a part of the roof is. Uh, can we get killed by debris? Okay, let's stand over here. So, uh, here's the power plant. There is a way... Oh, emergency evacuation. We should probably click that real quick. There it goes. Oh, okay, the black hole's done. Oh, you can hear it. Uh, I hear the... Wait, is there an alarm going off? I can hear the uh, the talking over the uh, radio. Huh. Oh, there it goes. Oh, that's so cool. By the way, if you guys want to see some more teardown on the channel, maybe hit that thumbs up button. And if you guys want to see me explode more stuff, hit the thumbs up button. And if you guys are addicted to explosions and destruction like me, Hit that thumbs up button. All right, so I'm gonna read the description here in just a second. There is a button we can click to overload the reactor. All right, we need to break in real quick, huh? It's just, oh, this looks dangerous. All right, cut this open here. Uh, why is this not releasing, huh? There we go. Is this a room I'm, sp oh, this looks like a, oh, this is like a break room. Wait, where's the reactor at? Uh, oh, this is on fire. Uh, maybe it's through here. I could probably just click the, you know what, we don't need buttons. Let's just break open the door. You know what, we don't even need this. Let's just go pipe bombs. There we go. All right, so we made our own door here. Let's see what's on the other side. Is this the reactor? Ooh. I can hear more uh, stuff going off right now. By the way, we've got a uh, physics gun. This is one of the top items on the workshop. This is basically the Gmod physics gun. This thing's incredible. And Wait a minute. So the core's right there. How do we get to the core? Uh, maybe we should call an airstrike. You know, what? we're gonna save this. Well, uh, we gotta save some of these things for later in the episode. Okay, so I think this is the room potentially here. So, uh, maybe we'll get a shotgun out, and blow the door open. Oh, this looks dangerous. Um, where does this go? Uh, oh, that's the break room. Okay, let's go up the stairs here. Um, oh, buddy, this looks dangerous. Why would you give me this many buttons? Uh, so is this another, uh, okay, it's the evacuation button. Okay, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. the AC5 button. I feel like this is the meltdown button. Three, two, one, click. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, oh, that was a mistake. Oh, the whole facility's collapsing in on my head. What the heck? This is the coolest thing ever. Oh, I need to go. I need to go. You know, I need to turn on one of the mods where I can just fly around and... Oh, my... The whole facility is melting down right now. That is so incredibly cool. Okay, my frame rate is tanking. My computer is screaming right now, but this might be the best map ever in Teardown. I mean, I'm gonna say that probably multiple times because there's other maps we're gonna check out today. And oh, oh, we're sinking. What does that sound? Wait, wait, where are we going? Huh? Oh, we're still sinking. Uh, I think we're below where we were earlier. Hold on, let's get the shotgun out. I know the uh, frame rate's terrible right now, but I want to see what's in here. Are we near where the core was? Oh, this is the break room. It's like the whole facility sunk down. Okay, I am seeing stuff right now. We should probably get out of here. I'm pretty sure our skin's probably bubbling right now. And oh man, we are stuck. 
Alright, it's gonna take me a second, folks, to work my way out of this. So, this is what the outside of the facility looks like. So, it melted down. It didn't actually take out the tower itself. But yeah, everything's making weird noises, and uh, I think we need to reset the map because this is now a laggy mess. All right, so uh, we made a bad there. So what we're gonna do now, we need to stick a black hole right around that area. And what I'm gonna do, I'm actually gonna go back out to the main menu, and uh, here, let's look at this real quick. So on the black hole, we can really screw this up. Um. Is this a bad idea? This is a bad idea. So let's go ahead and make the max pull maximum and the pull strength maximum and the pull mass maximum. Uh, 60 seconds is fine. The black hole grow speed. Let's go ahead and max it out too. By the way, if you want this uh, facility, this is the NGNT nuclear facility by Cobes and contributors. Uh, there's a main page here for everybody else. So let's go ahead and jump back in, go into options. Let's do this early morning real quick. I think this is gonna make it night basically. Ooh, this is creepy and you know what? I just noticed. Oh, it's Mater. Well, that might be the creepiest thing I've ever seen. All right, so black hole at night. This is gonna be a mistake. All right, so we gotta remember, we can cancel this at any time. Actually, let's stick this inside of the facility here. So we're gonna break into Chernobyl and we're going to go ahead and uh, stick this in the core. So probably here. All right, uh, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, run, 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 run. Oh no, everything was a mistake. Oh, okay, keep backing up. Keep backing up. We're getting like two frames every second. So everything I just did was a mistake. We probably should have kept it at the default size. I'm still trying to back up. I feel like the front facing wall here is about to rip forward and go into the black hole. Um, this is fine. Everything's fine. My computer's fine, even though I can hear it right now. Normally I can't hear it with my headphones on. Um, I don't know what's gonna happen here. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna stay quiet and I'm gonna speed up the footage and see if something happens. Uh, I hear explosions, this is bad. So that was a huge mistake. Uh, we blew everything up and it was actually amazing. And the whole fact that you can melt down the, uh, the whole nuclear power plant, but we're going to move on here. We're in the junkyard map. And if you look ahead of us, we have the shredder 3000. I think it wants me to push this poor bus in there. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is incredible. Holy poop. Uh, Yes, I want to stick people in this. Wait, is that illegal? Well, I guess technically it is in real life. So, junkyard map. Tons of cars. You got a big bulldozer here. Uh, we still have our mods enabled. I turned the black hole down because obviously that was a bad idea. But, dude, look at this. Oh, this is going to be perfect. So, we got our physics gun. We should be able to lift cars. And then we can go, yeet! Uh, and the car is gone. But we can pretty much pick up any car and, like, drop it in the shredder. Wait, is there little shreddy things at the top? Like, I'm pretty sure there is, right? Oh, that looks dangerous. All right, let's grab cars and throw it in here. All right, so... Wow, this works exactly like the, uh, the Gary's Mod Portal Gun. Even with the little scroll wheel and uh, moving it in and out. So let's go ahead and drop this in there. Uh, I don't think stuff's supposed to go in this way. No, you're going to go in there and you're going to enjoy it. Get in there! There we go! Okay, wait, what's the back half look like? Oh, it looks like there was a back half. So does it just spit out or does it keep all the debris? I think it actually keeps it. Hold on, let me look in there. Oh yeah, it just stays in the back. Okay, here, let's move this. Oh, that was a mistake. Um, uh, uh, yeah, the uh, fizz gun is really powerful. Also, we have another fizz gun. It's called the ultra grab gun. And this is basically the fizz gun, except for it turns off the limits. So we can probably go to like a map and lift up a whole building. I don't know if we want to do that quite yet. So, hmm, this looks like a fancy car. Huh? Let's throw one more in here. Go, yay. Oh, it's having problems with the uh, the mud here. Also the wheel, I think, screwed up on it. Oh, 
Well, this is a piece of poo. You know what? Just chunk it in here. There we go. Oh, that looks incredible. All right, we need to get that ragdoll mod back out and throw some humans in there. So what else is there here in the uh, big junkyard? Man, there's so many cars. This is amazing. Also, Bob's Junkyard. I love the name. Huh, can I rip that sign down? Uh, I think it has to be loose. Oh, you know what? This is a perfect time to call in an airstrike. Oh, we've got a napalm strike. Hon, where is our AC-130? There it is. All right, call it in. Sorry, Bob. I need to loosen the sign. Oh, so the 25 millimeter cannon doesn't do much, does it? Hold on, let's let it go wide open. Just keep clicking it. Oh, that's cool. All right, so let's change the ammo here. Let's go 40 millimeter, a little bit bigger. Oh. Oh, let's uh, call an airstrike in on this construction equipment here. There we go. Stand back. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, hold on. Let's get another one. Let's go 105. Uh, this should destroy the garage, right? Uh-oh. Oh. Oh, man. Wait, can can you actually see it firing? Hold on. Let's go. Oh, you can. That's amazing. All right. Oh, it's calling a lot on the uh, garage here. Dude, you can hear that cannon just going off in the background. You can't spam it quite like you can the other one. All right, so we've got that. Hold on, let's call in a napalm strike real quick. Napalm. Where's the napalm? Oh. Wait, that was like a little flare. Wait, does this thing uh, have anything that's actually flammable in it? Is it catching on fire? Hold on, let's just call in a bunch of these. There we go. Bunch of napalm strikes. And up, oh, you can see all the smoke rising, and we're burning the building down now. All right, so this building is flammable. Was there anything important in here? Any secret vehicles? Oh, what was this? Oh, there was a nice truck in there. Hold on, go to the back garage. Anything uh, worth noting in here? No. All right, let's keep moving. What's this thing? Uh, this looks like a stack of crates. Oh, I need this door open. Hold on. I know how to open this door. There we go. Oh, we hit something else. Um... My bad. Oh, there was a vehicle up there. Hold on. I want you to shoot the gate down. There we go. Yeah, I guess it depends on where the uh, the plane is, where the cannon comes in from. All right. Oh, my. This is the most epic stack of cars ever. We could totally play car Jenga. So if I get the physics gun, I can go Hold on. Can we slide one of these out? Oh, oh. Okay, I can say I'm not very good at Jenga. <laughs> Holy man. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, so the AC-130 it goes away whenever you don't have the little tool out. I was about to say I wanted to yeet a car at it. That'd be kind of fun. I know there's some helicopter mods in the game. Maybe we can get one with the enemy at helicopters and we can throw uh, cars at it. Uh, let's grab this car. Let's go. Wait a minute. Is that a crane with a big ball on it? Can I jump inside of you? Uh, yes, please. Hold on. Let's, uh, let's pull all the weapons, or let's put all the weapons away. Um, uh, I think we enter this way. Oh, we can drive this. You gotta be kidding me. All right, so there's the shovel. Can we, wait, how do we bring the ball up? Uh, it kind of sits on the ground. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, that's driving. There's no other control for actually, oh, I guess we just gotta actually get momentum and Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, 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 this is fine. We're breaking stuff. All right, here comes the ball. Come on, and... Oh, we're hitting cars. Yeah, I wish I could lift it up. We're just making a lot of uh, holes in the ground. Oh, there it goes. You know what? This isn't working as good as I want it to. I've got to do something else here. Not the airstrike. I kind of want to throw a black hole in the middle of all these cars. I feel like that could be amazing. Hold on, let's go. There we go. All right, just stand back. This is gonna get, okay, stand back really far. Oh, this is gonna get messy. All right, so it's gonna slowly eat these cars up here. And Oh, it's dragging cars from over here. You know, I feel like we could get away with a little bit more with the black hole instead of turning it all up to max. Maybe go about a quarter ways up or maybe even half ways because no telling what it would do. Dude, it's moving the ground. Like, what got broken up by the airstrike, it's actually sliding that in. But is it actually eating these cars right now? I don't see anything. It's just all the cars have been pulled towards the center. And it's like they're buckling right now. What is going on under there? Okay, I feel like we've uh, had peak black hole here. Like, this black hole is basically done. So, you know what? We have to do it. Since the junkyard has so many loose items... Why don't we just get a black hole powerful enough to pull up the whole junkyard? 
So I'm guessing the center point is right around maybe here. But yeah, I think maybe placing it here would be good. It should drag all those cars that are in that stack this way and then maybe drag some of the stuff on the building this way. Uh, also, by the way, can I grab this with the physics gun? Oh, and there might be some loose parts here now. Oh, look at that. Oh, yeah. Dude, we could tear stuff apart with this thing. Oh, let's grab the toolbox and just send it through the walls. Wow. <laughs> oh, yep. We basically broke it down. Hold on. Let's grab this card. Let's go. Uh, and then. Uh. <laughs> oh, the destruction physics on this game are amazing. Oh, this is a bomb. Oh, and let's go. Yep. Yeah. Oh, that was cool. Uh oh. Oh, there goes the pole. All right. It's crashing through there. Okay, so yeah, I think that's what we need to do. Hold on, let's do a little bit more exploring real quick. So I feel like there's a couple more really cool vehicles. And then we will set off the biggest black hole. And oh dear. This thing is the most beautiful car I've ever seen. What the heck is this? Hold on, this is going to be fun. Oh, yes. That just pulls the car back towards the vehicle and it just destroys everything. There's a lot more to this map than I thought there was. And oh, look at the debris. That, that's a sight and a half right there. Oh man. Yep, we are doing it. This is peak teardown. Yeah, it's been a while since we played the game and I didn't realize it got this amazing. And on, we're gonna go through the fence here. Let's get some of the parked cars. Yep, right through the fence. Go and eat up some of the employee cars there. Look at the path of destruction we have behind us. We're also tearing up the ground here. Like, this is a multi-purpose vehicle. And, oh, there's a whole group of cars over there. It's unbelievable how many uh, groups of cars there are here. It's a lot of loose objects, yet the game is handling it uh, great. Uh, let's uh, take down some of these bigger diesels real quick. Oh, tear them up. Come on. Oh, that one's popping up. Come on. Dig through it. This is, might be one of the most destructive vehicles that I've ever played with on the game. Come on. Oh, and we got to see if it's going to tear through. It's having some problems, but I think eventually it's going to mulch its way through. There it goes. And it's coming down. And... Oh! Oh, keep driving through. Oh, man. Okay, I'm kind of glad we, uh, we went searching around a little bit more. I wouldn't have found this vehicle if not. Oh, boy. We We're just casually driving through the, uh, the garage here. I kind of wish I could bring this uh, vehicle to other maps. There's a couple, like, maps with huge buildings I'd love to just grind through like this. Oh, that was something. I'm proud of my work here. We kind of cleaned up the garage, to be honest. Uh, it was pretty toasty. We made, like, a big section here. It's like a new drive through section. Okay, so let's go grab that black hole. Okay, so we've done it. We've turned up the black hole. I don't know what's going to happen. I feel like I wanted to stick it over there by that pile, but... Look at the pile over here. This is way more cars. So if we shove it in the middle of this, actually, better yet, there's another one on the other side, is there not? Let's stick it in the middle of the parking lot so it should suck the cars from this side in and then hopefully suck the cars from the other side and get the employee cars too. Uh, at least I think that's the way I adjusted this. Let's see if it works. All right, three, two, one, go. Waiting for it. Waiting for it. Uh-oh. I think it needs to be turned up. Wow. All right, we're back again. The black hole is out. I turned it up even more. Let's give it a second. Oh, no. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, this was a mistake. This, okay, this was a big mistake. Uh, we're not gonna get hit in the face by something from the rear and, oh, no. How is the game not completely imploded? Uh, okay, this is fine. This is fine. We're sucking up the cars from both sides. Uh, I feel like it's not a wise decision to stand anywhere as close to this because those cars are just flying in. And it is creating a massive pile here. Wow. I'm almost speechless here, folks. What are we doing? <laughs> oh, boy. I get paid to do this, by the way. This is my job in real life. Well, I mean, when I say in real life, it's the YouTube thing. Like, I get paid to destroy cars and throw everything in the middle and oh there's construction equipment coming okay you know what we're gonna crank up some classical music we're gonna speed this up and let's see what happens here
So that was something. I'm not really sure what we learned here today in Teardown. We learned that Komodo likes destruction too much, and Komodo shouldn't be allowed within about 50 miles of any nuclear power plant. But you guys know what to do if you want to see some more Teardown. Maybe hit that thumbs up button. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. And uh, we'll see you guys next time.